It's been a tough week in the Sammamish community of Clohane. Uh, vandals targeted homes and cars with graffiti. Much of it included racist slurs and symbols. King 5's Amy Moreno is live where they gathered for a rally this evening. Yeah, that event wrapped up a short time ago, and one of the nice things to see about it is neighbors stayed here for a long time talking to each other, and they said that was really the goal, to bring everyone together to talk about what happened last week with that graffiti that has been popping up around this area. Some of it very offensive, some of it including uh, racist slurs and symbols. But they wanted to get together to talk about that and then also to push back and try and come together as a community and send a message of love and acceptance to let people of all different backgrounds know they are welcome in this community. It was a pretty broad crowd out here today. They had some local elected leaders, but also many who just live in this neighborhood and want to send a message, including some young children. There is more that unite, unites us, and that's, and that's why we destroy the hate, and, and that's why we're all here today. And we are here for you, and we're going to continue to Find the people that did this, and we'll let you know uh, our successes or hopefully our arrests. And the city of Sammamish police chief was among those who came out here tonight. She said they are still very active on this case, but she also really wanted to keep the focus tonight on this community coming together. Uh, one of the local elected leaders, the mayor, talking about how one of the good things that can come from all this is how people are getting to know each other. They know their neighbors a little bit better, and maybe through all of that, they can figure out who's involved in this and hopefully put an end to this graffiti that's shown up over several days last week. We're live in Sammamish, Amy Marino, King 5 News.